Erica, Erica Sager. Oh shit, it's Erica Sager. Yeah. Hey guys, just a random update here. I just ate my last meal, the last supper, and I just had some chocolate, so we're all good. But what I'm gonna do now is remove my nail polish. I don't entirely know why. If I do find out why, I'll put it like here, but I have to remove my nail polish for surgery. But yeah. Hey guys, <laughs> welcome to surgery day. So I just like officially woke up. I didn't have the best sleep of my life. Shocker. And then I wake up and fall asleep and wake up and fall asleep, but whatever. My surgery isn't until 12.30, like p.m. And it's currently like 7.45 in the morning, but I wanted to wake up this early because I take daily medication. So I just want to separate surgery time and water time and my pill time by as much time as I can. All right, I'm done. <laughs> So my plans before surgery include buying frozen peas because we forgot to do that for like icing my face. I'm gonna shower. And lastly, I'm going to read through like all my surgery packets, everything, and just make sure that everything's set. And then we're leaving for the office around 10.30. I need to be there at 11.30. I'm leaving in like two and a half hours-ish. So I have plenty of time to like do whatever. Um, but yeah, so I'll check back in with you guys when I'm about to leave and show you guys what I'm wearing, what I'm bringing, everything like that. So. Let's see. Oh, here they are. Oh, nope. I feel like these are really big bags though. Oh my god, my hand looks like I recently discovered that I have, um, toe thumbs, so I'm still reeling. Oh, these are BOGO too. I just showered and now I'm in my surgery outfit. They tell you to wear something button up or zip up and this is my choice. And I think I'm gonna wear flip flops. Okay guys, we are on our way to surgery. I'm so excited. I don't really feel that nervous. Um, I'm just a little upset I couldn't eat today because I feel a little hungry. We have arrived at the surgery center. It's up there. My mom brought a bag of stuff. Activity bag! She's camping out. <laughs> they taped my ear and we're about to go. <laughs> What's up y'all? So we chilled. I don't really see much. Swelling. Once they rolled me into the uh, operating room, I just saw the lights and then I said, Let's see. There's literally no way I can see my side right now. Yeah. We're gonna drive home and I'm thirsty and my head hurts a lot. So, cheers. I definitely started to get some bruising in my eye. I don't know if you guys can see, cause I can't really see what I'm doing. <laughs> yeah, I need to change this drip pad ASAP Rocky. But honestly, getting my eyebrows down for this was such a move. Like, look at those puppies, okay? They look good. Peace. I okay. think they had to harvest the squash. We just got better. Hey guys, I know this isn't the cutest pickle, I'm sorry, uh, but no I'm not. So, we ready to take the car? Hey guys, I did my first drip pad. What's up? Five star service. Oh, this is my post-surgery setup. I got water, uh, definitely a straw you're supposed to use so this doesn't touch your nose. My dog, um, and then mac and cheese, and I brought chopsticks so I don't have to open my mouth too much. I can't taste any of this. It's such a cool thing. This might be my last update for the night just cause like I'm just like eating. Uh, I'm about to start icing my face cause I have some bruising coming in. And then I'm going to take a pain pill and probably go to bed so. Yeah I'll see you guys tomorrow. So I didn't think I'd be updating you guys anymore, but I'm crying. 
and I don't really know why, but I, I know it has, I know, I like, my mom told me this, but I knew it, it had something to do with anesthesia. Is that true? Hello? Yes. But I'm fine. It's about 9 a.m. on officially day one. I'm calling day one the day after surgery. Um, my bruising is increasing a lot since this morning. Sorry, I'm like kind of talking low because my sister's asleep. Shh. So since I last updated you guys, I ate breakfast, aka a yogurt. I have no appetite. But before that, I started taking my vitamins again. So nothing really hurts right now. Um, so yeah, but this is the bruising right now. I was just icing a lot, so that's kind of all I'm doing is icing, but yeah. Guys, so my mom got me this to organize all my pills. So I'm just putting in all this stuff that I have to take before I eat whatever after i eat stuff like that so i'm just filling this puppy up and i think this is going to be really helpful for me okay guys this is my soup it's butternut squash soup from panera uh i have two herb and eggs that i covered in garlic powder and pepper since i'm not supposed to have any salt and then i just have a green smoothie with a bunch of pineapple pineapple juice spinach stuff like that and this is my sister studying for her gre tomorrow good luck Hey guys, I just wanted to do a little check-in since I think my last check-in was at like 6 a.m. this morning. Um, after I filmed that, I went right back to bed, so that was really good for me. I honestly can't even think of any updates, really, just like my eyes swelling went down a lot. The bruising is going away pretty quickly. Um, it looks like it's starting to yellow, actually, I just noticed. Which is funny, it's really, it's 
been less than 48 hours since I got out of surgery. But yeah, I still don't really have an appetite, but I'm drinking a lot of orange juice and pineapple juice because of like the anti-swelling stuff and a bunch of vitamin C. Also, just another slight update. I don't know why, but my lips are really light. Like they're very pale. Could have to do with so many things. It could have to do with the fact that I haven't eaten a lot or that I'm not hydrated enough. It's still day two, but what I will say is my cheeks are starting to swell and I'm definitely feeling a little bit of pain in this area. Yo, low key, the fridge lighting kind of slaps. I'm trying to find a snack. We're about to go watch Sunset. I'm still kind of on a soft diet, like I had soup last night, all I'm eating is yogurt, I'm gonna have more soup tonight, but I need a snack. That was my attempt at winking. So we just at the beach or whatever. Hello. as I've compromised access to my face, I'm still trying to stay on top of it in terms of cleaning it. And like low key, she's been glowing and I haven't washed her in three days, so that's pretty cool. But I have been wiping my face with these simple face wash wipes. I literally look like a chip. Okay guys, happy Thanksgiving. Um, These are all the pills I have to take before I eat anything. It's bromelain, my probiotic, Keflex, acetaminophen, hydrocodone, and my steroid. Breakfast is served. Hey guys, we back. We're doing a turkey trot, but we're doing like a really short one. So it's only like two and a half miles, but four. Okay guys, um, just updating you. It's later on Thanksgiving. My cheeks are super swollen. I know there's some bruising going on right there, but I just look super funny. All right, y'all, the updates are definitely coming to a slow because not much is changing. The bruising on my cheeks exists. Um, my lips have been so dry that they've been peeling, AKA I've been picking at them. So um, that's not really cute, but still can't breathe out of my nose really. I can breathe in through my nose, like, I don't know if you can hear that, but I can't breathe out. And then also, because I've been sometimes breathing in through my nose, but I can't breathe out, I have to cough. And I've been coughing up some blood, which isn't cute, but it's normal, so not to worry. Yep, that's about it. I look like a square, and I'm gonna go now. Okay guys, it is day five now, just checking in quickly, still have cheek swelling and bruising, yellowing of the eyes, and nothing has changed, but I just want to check in to check in, so yeah, I'm about to go to the movies, I'm a very mobile person during this process, that might just be me, everyone's experience is different. Um, I was super tired yesterday and I'm super tired today and my legs hurt and I couldn't fall asleep last night at all so slight update I don't know but okay guys it's day six now I get my cast off tomorrow which I'm really excited Hello. about um, my cheek swelling actually has gone down today but it honestly looks like I have some new bruising under my eyes but that's the update. Hopefully my next clip will, will be me on my way to get this thing off my face and see my final result. Okay guys, we are en route to my cast removal day. I feel like I'm graduating low key. Yeah, I'm graduating my rhinoplasty, except I do get another cast on literally right after. Um, but cheek swelling is almost back to normal. I think I just have a little chubby face. Uh, but, steroids. Yeah, it's the steroids too. Um, I do still have this bruising that hasn't yellowed and it's been here for like five days, so I don't know what that's about. But I do have some new bruising under my left eye that's purple, but whatever. Um, but I'll check in with you guys when I'm getting my cast off. 
We're about to walk in and I'm just feeling so anxious. I think you could probably sit, Mom. Uh -uh. The whole nose just heals up that much better. But you look in the mirror and say, oh, okay. But you've kind of Ooh. forgotten, so it's not. So we're gonna change. actually see the result right now. You're gonna see a hint of a, a result. hint, It'll right? Be so pre, yeah, pre, it'll be swollen. super swollen. Pre, -fold. everything's swollen. So the stuff I look for on a day like today is basically <laughs> whatever. Wow, I, I didn't see. feel a bump when you did okay. that. <laughs> so basically, what I look for today, I'm looking at the inside being perfectly straight. Yeah, it's perfect. I'm looking for the bones feeling like they're in the wow. right place and they're perfect. I'm looking for the in relation to dorsal contour. The whole skin envelope is really quite swollen. So, but the stuff I'm looking for today for a week out from surgery is pretty much perfect. Want to see it? Yes, yes please. So take a little peek. So you're getting there. So, but see, <gasps> it's, it's puffy though. Oh Pretty no, funny. but I know it's going to look so... I see. You're only going to get better. All right. Now, a little bit of looking and then what I want to do is get this tape back on <laughs> so we can control swellings. Um, I'm pleased today. Everything I want to see, you're giving me. <laughs> Keep it up. <laughs> okay, guys. Here we go. I know you just saw it, but like. <laughs> this is the best investment I've ever made and actually the only investment I've ever made, really. Oh, I'm so happy. I used to hate my left side. I'm really jealous at how much you like your nose. <laughs> Do you wish me ill, woman? Honey, what? You are perfect. Thank you. Is She's, her? This is going to officially conclude my rhinoplasty journey vlog. Everything. My surgery, my journey, days one through seven, and the cast removal as well. It's still a little tender. But I'm definitely going to be making a follow-up video and showing you guys progress as the swelling goes down. It wasn't even that swollen, but... I'm sure it'll get even better as the swelling goes down but if you guys have any 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 questions be sure to leave them below or you can hit me in my dms on instagram my handle is at erica sager that's the same for twitter everything like that but i hope you guys enjoyed this video and got something out of it don't forget to like and subscribe down below and turn on post notifications for all my upcoming videos especially all the updates about this whole thing and yeah Thanks for watching. Bye guys.